Good afternoon, guys. It is March 15th. It's Thursday, and it has definitely been a while since my last vlog, so I apologize for that. The last time you guys saw me, it was my brother's wedding, which was so much fun, by the way. If you haven't watched that vlog, definitely go watch it. The link for that will be in the description box below. Now, it is literally the day of my Wilmington trip, guys. I am going to the One Tree Hill Convention in Wilmington, North Carolina, and I've never been more excited for something in my freaking life. I bought the photo ops to uh, meet Chad Michael Murray and James Lafferty. So I'm super excited about that. So I'm just running some last minute errands. I'm coming to talk to my bank real quick. I'm gonna go ahead and cash before my trip. And then I'm also um, gonna let them know like I'm going out of state because my bank always seems to uh, mess up on that part, but whatever. And then I have to run to Walmart to get some like toiletries and stuff. I did just work a 12 hour shift the night shift so I'm on just a couple of hours of sleep but I'm too excited to even really care yeah I'm super excited my cousin Ronnie is coming with me actually right now she's about 15 minutes away so I think I'm just gonna run my errand and then uh, we're gonna take off to San Antonio our flight is until like 8 so we literally have time it's 2 15 right now so anyways um, now I'm at Walmart I have the meet and greets to meet James Lafferty and Chad Michael Murray which I'm super freaking excited about I literally love them both so much I really wanted to meet Stephen Coletti who plays Chase I was gonna actually wait until like the last minute to buy his tickets which probably wasn't the best idea because now they're all sold out so I'm super bummed about that but I don't know I'm just trying not to think about it. Good morning, guys. We are just leaving our first hotel for the trip. We are in Dallas right now. And yeah, I didn't really get much sleep. Right now we're heading down to go wait for a shuttle to take us to the airport. And then we are heading to Charlotte, North Carolina. First, isn't that our first stop for the day? And I think we have like an hour lay over there and then we'll be in Wilmington. Hey guys, so we're at the airport in the morning. I changed by the way, it was super hot. But um, long story short, we missed our flight by like minutes. We had to reschedule our flight. So now we're leaving at 8.55. It is about like seven o'clock right now and we're gonna go get breakfast. So don't mind my hair or my face or my body. We are now at Chick-fil-A. So we got the, what are the chicken minis? Chicken minis. Anyways, I don't think I really explained what happened. Long story short, we missed our flight. And basically, it was the most stressful hour and a half. Two? I literally almost felt sick. Hey guys, so we are now in the hotel room. We are now dressed. I'm just wearing uh, this red and black sh shirt with some shorts. Um, my legs are super white because I didn't tan because I never wear shorts. Ronnie's right there. And I'm kind of bummed because my camera, I'm not sure how you guys can see this, but um, one of the screws came off. It's not a good situation. So we're waiting for our Uber to come and then we're gonna go head over to the convention center so that we can register. And I have a couple questions with the meet and greet stuff. Uh, we have a meet and greet to meet Chad and James at the same time for a photo op. And I'm pretty sure that J um, Chad has like something going on on Saturday. So I think they rescheduled it. So we got to figure out what's going on with that. But let's go ahead. I think we're going to head downstairs so that we can wait for our Uber. Hey guys, so we just left the registration for the One Tree Hill Convention. We got everything figured out. Basically, we're going to be here Saturday, but uh, Chad Michael Murray and James Lafferty's uh, photo op is going to be on Sunday. So we get to come in for a little bit on Sunday, which is totally cool. Um, and then we also just bought one ticket for Stephen Coletti's photo op and we're just gonna go in together. It's gonna be really exciting. Now we're actually walking um, down the street. I think we're gonna go to Karen's Cafe and try and like look at the shops and then close over Bro's and Karen's Cafe. I'm shook. And I'm also gonna get a Karen's Cafe t-shirt. I'm really excited about it. Wow. Hey guys, so we are on the river walk now. Um, we've been meeting super nice people all day. Also, we've been taking some super cute pictures. We ate earlier at the Copper Penny. Look at how cute this area is. Like everywhere. We just left the Naily table. It's literally right there where these people are taking pictures. Again, we met so many nice people. Like in the short time that I was talking to you guys. I think we took some really good pictures. We just finished with the river walk. Actually, we're not done, but we just decided to call it a day because she has not finished One Tree Hill. So we want to get like some episodes in. Like, you're not going to finish it by the No, long. I should have done my homework. You should have done your homework. I just never had the chance. And but, now I regret it, I really do. Yeah, it was a really fun day and we cannot wait for tomorrow. So I will probably talk to you guys then. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Good morning, everybody. I'm here with Ronnie. 
again. And uh, we're walking back to Target because I need some last minute things that I forgot when we were there last night. It's like 9.30 a.m. and we are headed to the convention. I think we're gonna hang out there for the majority of like today at least, like half of the convention. Yeah. And then we're gonna go do some like sightseeing, the location, the filming locations and stuff. And we're just gonna have a lot of fun. We're gonna meet Steven Coletti today. I also need to get a screw for uh, this camera because I'm literally holding the screen up. Hey guys, so now we are sitting down and we're waiting for, I don't know what we're waiting for actually, but we're just sitting here enjoying the convention. I got like a bunch of merch already and I don't think I'm done yet. I probably should be done because let's be real, I don't have that kind of money. So they just started calling for Steven's meet and greet and I'm so excited. Okay, so we are now in line to meet Steven Coletti. I'm really excited. The line seems really long. That's for Barry, aka Whitey. Guys, we just met Steven Coletti. He was so nice. He like gave me a hug. He looked like he like when he looks at you, he looks into your soul. Yeah. And he I like felt that. he like I looked at me that. and he was like, hey, how are you doing? Guys, he's beautiful. <laughs> He's so sweet. It was only like a second, but it felt like an eternity with him. Yeah, it like did. it really did. How many times was James shirtless? Hello. Hi. Good. How are y'all? Hey guys. So we are walking outside of the convention now uh we got our picture with steven i think i told you guys that i think i just uh recorded well i recorded a little bit of walking down the hey. <laughs> um i recorded a little bit of us like walking past um like some of the cast members but then i felt bad for recording them because i think they knew fergie and junk both were like said hi to us and like hey how y'all doing so I don't know I feel bad so that's why I stopped recording junk Fergie Drew Seeley was there he was there and he's so good like Haley's sister oh Jimmy Edwards was there I was I really wanted a picture with him but honestly we could always go back and take one so yeah now we're walking downtown I think we're gonna go to this place called crazy Mike's we like met some like people in line everyone's been so nice I love convention and they told us where to go to find like some really good merch I already spent a lot of money on merch but they really didn't have that much and then we're also gonna like look for some of the locations that the show was filmed at and take pictures there okay guys so we are now back at the daily table so we went uh, shopping at another store that like has all the merch it was called crazy Mike's so if any of you guys are watching and you guys want to come to a one tree hill convention in the future go to crazy Mike's they have everything and now we're at the daily table we bought markers last night I'm just gonna write my initials Okay guys, here we go. I'm just gonna write One Tree Hill. Okay guys, it's like 2.30. We are walking to Lucas's house. The houses are beautiful here. This like girl that we met, I'm not sure if I said earlier, but we met like a fan at the convention that gave us a whole list of all the locations. Hey guys, so we are at Lucas's house, but it's private property, so we're not gonna like get on their property, but this is the house. Uh, right there is Lucas's room. So it's right here. I literally can't believe like we're here. It's literally right there. That's Lucas Scott's house, guys. So many stuff was filmed here, it's iconic. So this is the front of Lucas Scott's house. And as you can see, they have like a private property sign there, but I guess we can still take pictures out here. Like as long as we're not like going on there like actual yard you know what i mean hey guys so uh now we are here at peyton's house which is right here uh we just got done taking pictures over there and everything that's peyton's house that's where i th believe it's that window right there where derek falls out and now uh there's as you can see there's people trying to take pictures at Haley's house who knew that Haley lived literally right across the street from peyton that's freaking crazy guys this is where the infamous kiss took place. Naley's first kiss happened right here. All right guys, so we just finished at Haley's house and now we're waiting for our Uber and we're gonna go to the bridge. So we are now back at our hotel. So we ended up going to the bridge and I didn't record there, but our Uber was super nice. He like ended up, like when he found out where we were going, he was like, do you guys want me to wait here for you guys? Like, cause like y'all are gonna need another ride. So basically like he ended up parking to the side of the road and then he offered to take a picture for us. And he took his pic he took a picture like a, of both of us and we still wanted to take more pictures. So he went back to the car 
waited and then we got a ride from him back to our hotel like that was super nice of him um i think we're gonna go back to the convention we honestly like left the convention after our picture with steven coletti oh you know what speaking of i don't think i showed the vlog so this is our picture I think it's super cute. That's our picture with him. Steven looks so great as usual. Then we, we took like pictures in the photo booth, which is super cute. And then we both get one, so that's like cool. Yeah, but uh, we ended up, because we wanted to go look at like as many locations as possible, which I'm glad we did because like we only hit up three spots, right? The bridge, Peyton, and Haley's house. Oh no, four, and um, okay. Lucas's house. And technically we went back to Karen's cafe. Hey guys, so we are at Trick. We've been taking pictures here. Uh, this is the wall. We wrote stuff over here. Oh, I wrote this. I had to give myself a shout out on YouTube. And I think I wrote two more times. I can't remember where. Right here. There's only one tree hill and it's your home. Hello from my hometown and check out my YouTube. And then I also wrote right here. I'm just trying to get that promo guys. So this is trick. Hey guys, so we are now back at our hotel. It's right over there, but we are walking. We should probably get on the sidewalk. We are walking to go um, eat because honestly, guys, I have not eaten all day. I just forgot, I guess. Ronnie had a slice of pizza earlier um, yeah. at the convention. Right before Steven. I think you guys saw, actually, maybe. if It might be in the vlog, but anyways. Oh yeah, I was eating. Yeah. Embarrassing. Good morning guys, it is 10.30 a.m. and we are back at the convention. We are just here to do our Chad Michael Murray and James Lafferty photo op picture, the Scott brother photo op picture, and we are super excited. I just had a little bit of a scare. Uh, my card wasn't working and we have one full day here. I knew something was off last night because I tried to get an Uber and it said like I had insufficient funds, which is not true. So I was a little nervous. Um, and then today I tried buying a t-shirt and my card was not working and i was freaking out i'm not gonna lie but i just uh, went to cash and it's all fine now hey guys so we are now sitting down um in the convention ronnie is eating pizza literally yesterday all over <laughs> all over again um but i'm not eating anything because i don't usually eat breakfast it's still a little too early for me actually it's not early at all for me but i think we're gonna wait till after we take the scott brothers pictures they're like calling row by row technically we could actually go and wait outside but you're eating now so <laughs> I actually just met Drew C. Lee, but he doesn't have like a big role. He's just like has a couple lines here and there. But I also know, like, love him from like other stuff that he's been in. He was the voice of Troy Bolton in the first high school musical. Let's not forget. Do you not know that? Yeah, he, he was the voice of Troy Bolton, the vocals. Yeah, like Breaking Free, that's like mainly Drew C. Lee. Yeah, Breaking Free is Drew C. Lee. He was so nice. Was he not? He was so nice. And like, I feel like every time we walked by, he like would look good. Like, yeah, he was. We were like in line. We decided to like try and wait in line, but then we left um, for the Scott Brothers pictures. And uh, he walked by and he like double, he like double take. Like he like saw it. Yeah, he did. He like saw us and then he like looked back and he smiled and I was like, hi. It was so great. I also wanted to meet Colin Fix who plays Jimmy Edwards. So I uh, took a picture with him. So I'll enter the picture. <laughs> so I'll enter the picture of Drew Seeley and Colin Fix right now sorry if the lighting's really bad i can't tell honestly but um we are now out of the convention we're out of breath <laughs> so yeah we let just let the convention center um honestly we were just talking about it like to ourselves right now but like i think the second day was so much more fun we weren't even there long honestly like we just took our photo op with chad and james they were so nice it kind of went by really fast so i feel like we didn't really get to like experience it but that's what a meet and greet is that went by really quick i met fergie i i know i talked to you guys about that but yeah we ended up meeting uh, or saying bye to fergie he was so nice and he gives the best hug and he remembered her name and he remembered me that's right yeah i was like like i went by and i was like i was like hi like i just wanted to say bye you know like we're leaving we're gonna go explore wilmington for our last day here and he's like michelle right and i was like oh my gosh yes thank you he's really nice um he remembered, and he remembered that we were from Texas. Yeah, he did remember us from like that we were from Texas, and he told he told us to be safe. And then um, Drew Seeley has been like eyeing us all day long. I'm just I saying. Know. Every time we pass by him, he like looks at us and he'll like say hi and he'll like smile. He has he's so good looking. Yeah, so good looking, and he's so sweet. Hey guys, so um, I'm not sure if you can see me. I feel like the lighting's really bad here, but we just got finished eating. Uh, we ate at the slice of 
life? Slice of life? Yeah. We ate at a place called The Slice of Life and it's like a, a pizza place and apparently it was Chad Michael Murray's like favorite pizza place in Wilmington. So we went. Um, I actually didn't have pizza. I'm not really that big of a pizza person. Now we just came to uh, the River Court, guys. The River Court actually isn't here anymore, but uh, it's like now just like a park, I guess. Um, and I'm like looking over there, guys. I can literally see where they like park their cars and like you can like I can like see I can envision like the basketball court here and it's just freaking crazy I can't believe we're here at the river court um and yeah it's right actually right next to like a ship uh what is it called the battleship, the battleship. yeah it's like a battleship but instead we are coming to this lot right here where the river court was you can see where they would park their car the naily table is right over there and up there is like where they had the burning of the boat if you guys remember like early on in the season so i'm about to write on one of the tables here is the river court i ended up putting the date and then i just put one tree hill forever in my name guys we are at brooke davis's house right now it's so crazy the houses here are insanely beautiful i think someone's home actually but they don't seem to mind that everyone's been taking pictures here there was a group of girls that were here earlier and they just left Good morning, everybody. It is 2.40, I believe. Yeah, 2.40 to be exact. And uh, we are up and I'm all ready to go. This is my airport attire. Um, I'm wearing my clothes over bros hat, which I'm probably not gonna wear the whole time. Um, and some like yoga pants. And then I'm wearing my uh, Keith Scott body shop sweater. And yeah, I'm just wearing my glasses today. I just put like the usual makeup on. We haven't, we were scheduled to pick us up at three. And and our flight is at 5.30 a.m., which is why we're going so early because we are not having a repeat of the way over here. And we should be back in San Antonio by like 9.30. I'm really sad, I don't wanna leave here. Wilmington has been so nice and it's just felt like such a good vacation. Unfortunately, it is back to reality, but it's been a great trip. We're now at the airport and yeah, I just realized, well actually Ronnie realized it, which is like so obvious because it's literally the only airport in Wilmington. Yeah, this is where they filmed like a lot of the airport scenes, obviously, in Wintry Hill. Brooke and Peyton meet when they come back in season five. But yeah, we're just waiting to go through security now. I'm gonna have to check in my bag. I was hoping that I wouldn't, but it doesn't look like it's gonna fit in the overhead bins, which is a problem. It is 3.30. And I'm like high key hoping that we see one of the actors from the show, because it's like a small airport, so it's a very big possibility. Um, yeah, it is like 2.45 p.m. I am in my Tree Hill uh, Lucas Scott t-shirt. And we're actually at La Cantera. I think we're just gonna, what are we doing here? We're gonna eat? Yeah, and go to Kendra. Yeah. So I can get something half off for Ricardo. I'm actually really hungry and I'm really sleepy, but um, we're gonna do it. So I don't know if you can see me. It's a little bit later, we already ate. Oh wait, I wasn't pressing yeah. it. We ate and now we uh, went to Carlo's Bakery. It's new. And we got some, what, Carter, what, what is this called again? I don't know. I got the dark chocolate, chocolate individual mousse cake. So we are now leaving uh, the mall. I'm super sleepy, like I'm actually exhausted. I'm excited though, thank you so much. Was it supposed to say Scott on the back? Yeah. Kind of like Aaron, <laughs> Aaron Scott, kind of worked out. Turn on. So Aaron just tried on uh, the jersey and we are gonna do a reveal. Aaron, come out. <laughs> I love it. That's so cute. It matches. <laughs> Love it. Love it. Pizza. Can I get that on camera? Yes. No problem. So I knew you really wanted it. I did. I love it. That's what I've been wanting to order one online too. I, I just never I, did. did. I think I got 23 too, actually. This is my picture with Chad and James. What an experience. Honestly, I haven't even really been able to talk about the whole experience. I'm <laughs> I'm happy to be home, but I'm also like high key sad to be home and for like this whole experience to be over. Wilmington, North Carolina is probably one of my favorite places that I've ever been to and I really hope that I can go back soon. I'm hoping in October. Yeah, but uh, follow me on Instagram if you guys haven't already because I have been posting a ton of pictures from the trip.
Hey guys, so it is now a couple days later and I am back to the regular life. Super bummed about that, but what can you do? So I just wanted to come on and end this vlog like properly. So if you guys like this vlog, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel as well as my main channel. The link for that will be in the description box below. So with that being said, I will see you guys next time. Bye!